everybody, my name is Hannah Mayer, and today I will be talking about my experience so far working at McDonald's. Because as of right now, I'm still working there. And I want to say the pros and the cons of working there without tormenting anyone. Also, I'm going to tell you a few stories about working there. But I'm not going to say the real names of any of the employees in the stories for identity reasons. So I'm going to use my minis, aka dolls, to interpret the rules of the employees. Also, I don't want to get fired from my job just because I made a video about that employer. So I'm going to stick to the minis. So that's enough of that. So let's get started. Okay, so my story started sometime last May. Whenever my best friend, I'm not going to say who it is because you know who I'm talking about. She was bragging about her job when I didn't even have a job at the time. And was bragging about everything about her job. Okay, her job, by the way, was a lobby person at a different McDonald's than where I worked. Then, one day, I was on an app called Snag a Job, which is a job search app. I came across a job at a McDonald's. That was only about 15 minutes away from my house. So I went on my phone and applied for the job myself. Then a few weeks later, one of my managers, in this case, we will call her Jessie, for the sake of this video, called me in for an interview and asked me some obvious questions. For an example, she asked me, why did you want to work here? I'm not going to say my answer on this video for privacy reasons. So then, once I was done with the interview, I waited a few weeks until I got another call from Jesse saying, I would like for you to come in for an orientation. So I didn't know what that meant at the time, but now I know it means that you kind of get a tour of the McDonald's and to go over boring paperwork, but you gotta do what you gotta do to stay at the job. So I filled out the paperwork there. So then the next week I started working there and I met so many nice people even though I had to watch training videos on the first day in which was so boring even though it was part of your training. So just watch the videos and get them over with. While I was watching videos this nice person in this case, I'll call her Linnea, offered me a drink, and I said yes, I would love one, because I was so thirsty, so she brought me back a drink, and then I continued on with all of the videos. So then, the next day, this person, I'm going to call her Shannon for the sake of this video, was teaching me how to wrap breakfast burritos, because that is one of McDonald's best selling products. So like, I know how to wrap them and just in case the main manager, Rachel, for the sake of this video, says I must do that. Then Rachel said, once you're done with the burritos, we are going to have Bailey and Tara teach you how to use the fryer and the grill. So that's what I did until it was time to go. Okay, so then a few weeks later, when I was using the fryer, to make the fillet. Somehow I burned my finger really badly. So I had to do a different job for Rachel. So then Rachel asked me to come with Reagan because Reagan is going to teach you how to clean the lobby. And just in case she wasn't there or if Rachel needed someone to do the lobby for her. So Reagan taught me everything, but I really wasn't interested in cleaning lobby because it was like barf all over the place. But if Rachel says to do it, I got to do it. Along the way, I met some other people that I'm still really good friends with today. I also learned how to do other jobs like dishes, prep, line, cabinets, and much more. The only thing I didn't like was how many hours they were scheduling me. So I asked Rachel if she would cut back some of my hours because I didn't like working so many hours. And... If I didn't talk to her now, I wouldn't have enough time to make videos for you guys. And I love all of you guys so much. 
so I didn't want to cut back any more YouTube videos. So, she agreed with me and came up with a new scheduling plan. And now I'm happy, but there was still something wrong. I didn't like being awake at 7 a.m. just to come into work for no reason. And when Rachel scheduled me, she once in a while scheduled me at 7 a.m. And I'm usually really crabby in the morning, so like I begged her to change my schedule to only night shifts. Because it's much calmer at night. So, yeah, that's basically my story. And now I'm going to tell you guys five pros and five cons for working there. Because I don't want to go into details with it and just in case you're out there. And I'm not trying to be rude, but I'm going to just say the things that need said without giving any names. Okay? And before I say it, I want to say a message. I love you guys so much. And everyone who works where I work, thank you for looking out for a teammate who has special needs. Because without you guys, special needs people would have a really hard time finding a good job for them. So thank you, McDonald's, for giving me this wonderful opportunity to work with you guys. And I will always do anything you want me to do. Because I don't want to break any rules, okay? If I've ever tried to be crabby at work, I'm sorry. Because in my heart, I would never do that unless I'm really tired, okay? So, that's enough of my message, and let's go on with the pros and the cons. Pros of working at McDonald's include friends, work experience, life skills, discounts on food, and interacting with customers. Cons is one break per shift, rude managers, hairstyles, scheduling, and uniforms. Before I forget to say this message, I want to say it right now. I just hit 100 views on my underwater ABC gymnastics challenge video in less than 48 hours. I'm very proud of you all for watching that video. And if you haven't seen it, the link to it will be down below. Thank you all so much. And let's raise the amount of viewers to 200 views for that video alone. And the subscribers amount to 1,000 subscribers. Because if I hit at least 200 views for that video, along with at least 1,000 subscribers, I will do a challenge video of the viewer's choice. So, please comment below what challenge you want me to do. And I'll do that challenge on my thank you for 1,000 subscribers video. So, thank you all for so much for watching. And here's my closure part of the video. Before I forget to tell you, I will be doing a retainer slash braces update once every six weeks. So questions that relate to braces or retainers will only be answered during braces or retainer updates. And other topics will only be answered every 100 blocks. So be aware of it. Also, I'm still planning on doing videos once a week, but I'm not sure what days yet. But... Please expect to see a video on Wednesdays. If there's not a video on Wednesdays, then I'll post either Thursday or Friday. And everyone knows the reason. Because I don't usually know my work schedule until Sundays. So if I work like on a Wednesday night for any reason, I'll either post Thursday or Friday. So, yeah. And... Also, I will have some videos on the Musical Singing Life channel, aka my collab channel. So, if you're watching my videos because of my singing, the Musical Singing Life channel is my collab channel, obviously. I do with my friend Connor Cosgrove. And before I say anything else, I want to tell you guys what the channel is all about. So, the collab channel, aka Musical Singing Life, it's all about my singing and me singing my own songs. I wrote myself and Connor usually helps me write the songs. So if you guys want to join us on the club channel, please comment below. And I will ask you to do a singing video to see if you have what it takes. And once you film that video, please email it to blackwaymichael at yahoo.com 
because that is the main email I use. Auditions are going to be hosted from now until September 1st for the collab channel, so please audition ASAP. And by the way, Reagan Rogers is also a member of my collab channel because we decided to accept her. So, yeah. So, that's all for this video. And I hope you guys liked this video just as much as I did. Please don't forget to like, comment, and most importantly, subscribe. So, thank you guys for watching and have a fantastic day, everybody. So, bye for right now.